Okay, guys, this video is to tell you that the 2-in-1 that has a power limit of 6 amp is working good. And to show you that I don't have a load more than 3 amps, 3 or 4 amps. And the regulator is 6 amp. So, what we're going to do, switch on the meter on a maximum of 10 amp, switch the radio, and switch to it to in one. Okay, it initializes, and it's working on 300 milliamp only. Now, when I move the swash, it goes up to 0.6 milliamp to, to 1 amp. And when I when I move all the servos, including the radar servos, I will reach to 2.5 amp maximum. 2.5 amp. I'm moving all the servos to point seven. Okay, so now it's good. Now I'm going to load the servos. I'm pushing the swash down. I'm making some pressure. It will reach eight. Point eight. No, I'm moving the servos, and it just draw me up to 2.9 amp. Look, I'm pushing the servos, the swash, the whole swash. Look at the meter. I'm pushing it hard as I can. Three amp, 3.8 amp. You see the meter? and push it hard to load the servos and this is just drawing 3.5 3 amps ok I let it go and this is without load just 1.5 maximum 1.8 that is beautiful so the 2 in 1 is not the problem the problem is the 3GX that has a bug in the software, definitely. I have the current meter to in one regulated up to six amp and I'm just using three amp on load. On load with my hand, not on the blade. Thanks.